Wisconsin's gun deer hunt begins on Saturday. The DNR says there are changes in the rules that hunters need to know about before heading to deer camp. NBC 26's Eric Crest is live at 6 with the changes. Now the changes rolled out by the DNS, DNR this year aren't going to knock your socks off, but they're worth a look, whether you're a veteran hunter or a first timer. Sportsman shops are gearing up for the change in the season. We got a couple days till gun deer season, so very, very busy time for us. But forget about them preparing for the changes. Are you ready? As of 2014 statewide, you cannot pull the trigger at the coveted albino deer, but that's just the tip of the antler. Traditionally, the day before the nine day gun deer season, we have prohibited um, firearms. But that just changed. Go ahead, sight in your rifle prior to the opener without scaring any bucks off. But by the time you tag one, it better be your tag and you better be present. Once we get it to your vehicle or back to the cabin, once it's registered, then that's fine. And once it's on the road. Of course, somebody else can transport your deer, but make sure that your tag is on it. As far as feeding or baiting deer, it's no longer allowed within. 10 miles of where a deer was found with chronic waste disease. Two new counties are on that list. It's out in Shawano and we'll pack a county. So try to prepare for the changes by reading the newest regulations. Make sure you read it. Absolutely, it's the hunter's responsibility to read it. And yes, I, I feel it's very self explanatory. Now, next year, expect at least one more change the opportunity to electronically register your deer from the field. The DNR is testing the system with select hunters during the upcoming hunts. Eric Crest, NBC 26.